good bike today guys on artificial it's amazing i think you're gonna like the footage that we have i um, caught a lot on hard baits um, this is a mirror dean mirror lure here josh caught a couple fish on the azuri 3d slow sinker and even with the, the water that got in it we used for ballast <laughs> um, but yeah it was a good day caught a couple fish on bait um, only did that to see the differences between how that would do between the jigs because jigs was a big producer today jigs and hard baits so anyway i hope you guys like it and uh, let me roll some film for you bait man bait man josh Oh wow! <laughs> yeah, I don't like that. Oh yeah, uh, 18 inches right off the bat. 19. Wow, sweet. Yeah, first oh, throw. See, I'm on the trolling motor. This is what he does, yeah. and, and he and he throws bait. Just got an advantage. Yep. I'm still working to artfully place the boat. Get us on the right spot. This, so this is already told. What are you buying on? Here, here, we got them. This is gonna be a problem today. Put that there. There we go. Biggie chicken. Good one. Very nice. Yeah. That first one I was playing. Oh, that one? Yeah. I think maybe a mirror dean. Find one. Oh, I'm sure. Find one right here in this box. This, this, thing needs, this? this needs to dry out. We'll put it in that box. This one, that's the top, that's the top one of these. Where do you want to do this? It's shallow up there, so. Don't they like that too? Huh? Yeah. All right. It, that feels weird. Trout. Uh, it's a damn cold, man. Yeah. I mean, the daggum goobers. Y'all, yeah. yeah. they're eating jigs on record this morning. Yeah. They've been on hard baits we don't know yet. Fix the bun out. Definitely the law. Nice. On the mirror, Dean. On the mirror, Dean. Oh, come off. No. Come off. <laughs> they have treble hooks. There's what. Oh, man. That's the mirror, Dean, right there. Slow sinking suspension. Sweet. We followed that thing for a few minutes. Yeah. Got <laughs> halfway back. Uh huh. Yeah, take the chug to throw that thing up there. Don't weigh nothing. Don't yeah. weigh the size for you. Though. That would be good fit. Yeah. They look good. Yo, these oh, are worth, these oh are worth, no. These things are worth offshore just like this. Yeah. You got hit up there, and then they yeah. kind of moved out. Yep. There might be two different groups of fish. Absolutely no current at all. Uh, it's uh, done. But somehow, it's an hour and a half till. Blow. Yeah. <laughs> it's gonna blow it out. She tapped out, baby. Uh -huh. When I first started filming the jigs, uh, first couple of fish, it was, uh, it was pretty erratic movement that I was doing on the jigs. Now they're hitting the, the whole stick. Yeah, yeah, part. <laughs> Play a footsie with it. Yep. Oh man, it's having to Look at it hitting it. Mm -hmm. I see the line. Oh, there he That's is. That's because he's swimming to the boat with it. Oh, nice. Not even a mic. Mike, we're doing deeper. He stomped on him. Oh yeah, he was hung all up in that thing. Yeah, well, he wasn't coming off of that one. He's grunting. Look at that little fuck trout. Uh -huh. He's chasing that little mirror dude. On the mirror, Dean. Little trout. Good job, buddy. What's up? Right. Right there. <laughs> yeah. 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 Yeah.
That one can get that way. Can I put that there so that one can get a hold of it? Man, I had fixed this hard bait for so long, man. Mm -hmm. Oh, I missed them. They're acting funny, man. They are. They're not. They're not grabbing on. No. At all. They're they're very cold. Um, I imagine. Spirit ain't tricky, man. Okay, let's swim back to the boat with it. Uh -huh. You keep feeling tapping and you keep jerking it and going. Yep. Yep. Maybe it's tricky for something else, but they're not. It's like. You get a couple fish, you get a couple hits, and then they change the line. Yeah. The problem with, the problem with hard bait is when they, when they hit that, it ain't soft. Yeah. It's not yeah, normal. They don't want to keep it. No, they're not going to come off. in. So you got to hope that they hit a treble hook. Yeah. That's why I want straight hooks on them. I figure it wants a good fish there to fish. Doubled up. That's a nice fish there. Yes, sir. Sure. Guys, just so you know, I'm fishing with a white head oh, electric chicken there. right there. RL's got a fish in the back. The mirror dean. On the mirror dean. Super size fish. Beautiful. Right. There he is. Nice yeah. fish. I can't quite reach the camera, but we can get it out of him without hurting him. He's good, 14 and a half inches, but. We're gonna let him, let him ride. Let him live. Good fish. Yeah. Not my hands always in the way. <laughs> <laughs> One good thing about this, this mirror thing is you can carry it. Nice. You can throw it over shells. That's what this fish is done. Yeah, it is. I think. It looks like he wants to be. Yeah. He's he, he, he fighting. Fight. Oh, yeah, that's nice. Big, yeah, he's kind of hooked in the back of the head. He's, he's 17, probably. Yeah. Oh yeah, oh yeah. Alright, here we go boys. Here it is. Whoa. Oh yeah, there's You hook yourself with this uh this beard and don't play around. This is a this is a real nice trout right here. It's about 17 and a half. Good fish. And if you don't think they won't see that thing. I don't remember the model number of this particular one, but you don't think they can't see that. These these lures are known for getting hit just sitting. It's just what just happened just then. I twitched twice and let it sink to the bottom, and I started talking to Josh, and the rod just bent over. I mean, that's that's how easy it is to fish a mirror dean. You can fish it over shells, as you heard me saying, because you can control the rate. If you get hung in there, though, you'll cry with that. We gotta we gotta replace that. Though. <laughs> That's why you buy about two in a time. Whoa! Drag! Drag! Yeah. I'm gonna try this again. Oh, that's a nice fish. Yeah. You never know where these trebles. Right. Got him. Yeah. No, but he is. He's done his solid. He's good. Oh, I just missed one. No, of course. Oh, man. That's fun on these 4 to 6 class rods, man. Yeah. And we say 4 to 6, y'all. We're not talking about the line test. We're using 20. But the rods are 4 to 6 pounds. This is a big, this is a 20 inch fish here, guys. Yep, that's a 20 right there, buddy. That's a nice fish. Alright, right, y'all look at this one. That's 19 and a half, 20 inch trout. That was on the mirror dean also. So they're smoking this morning. That's, we're just showing y'all what we do. I'm retired and from charter fishing. Josh runs all that now. But we're just showing y'all what we go do when uh, the season's not in. And that's, that's all, it's not a competition. This is just about showing y'all how we fish and what we fish for. That's what we love. Yeah, fun. <laughs> 16 inch. Yeah. There we go. That's a good one. Nice. Put in that water. That one right there was on the yellow head gotcha Christmas tree, curl tail. One of our go-to favorites, always. You got a yellow head? Yep, yellow head. 
first time we've used him in a while. That's right. Yep. Nice. They're biting this morning, y'all. Plain and simple. They're chewing. Looks decent. More than decent. Oh, yeah. 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 Nice fish. There ain't nothing under 16 inches in here, Hogan. This is just one of those days. Yeah, it's rare. It's rare. What do they call them dog days? <laughs> I don't know. Whatever, trout days. Damn, they bite. <laughs> what it is. Woo! Yeah! Uh, get back in the water, buddy. Another good one right here, about 17. Up that, uh, yeah. Oh wow, that's an iron fish. Oh, he's in the pool. Oh no. <laughs> Let's get him up. Let me have him. That's a pretty fish. There you go. Alright, here we go. My hands in the way as usual. That is a big Sally right there. And he was on the Miradine once again. Good fish. They might not be in that, in that clear side. Which is strange. You think trout, you think clear water. It's not always like that. No, it is not. That's why we just fish where we go and we try. Yeah. You know, whatever it is, you gotta try. Yeah. And then and everything else, that's what it's you get upset when you make a 10 mile run, 12 mile run, you get there and it's muddy. I'm going to try it. I'm not going to say, oh, it's muddy. We need to move. You're already there. I'm there. I'm trying it for at least half an hour or more. Yeah, because it's, it's, it's such a. It's just like the other day. I mean, it's just, it outproduced everything. It, it does every time, though. It really does. Pretty nice, right in that nasty water. Halfway through the trough. Sitting, y'all. I don't know if you, if you rewind and watch, I, I twitched and it was sitting for maybe six, eight seconds. It was down near the bottom. It's only four feet. It's not a big trout, but it's a trout. It's way above a keeper size for sure. Like this. Yeah, yes. Yeah, don't come in there, boy. <laughs> but a mirror day ain't playing with it this morning, Josh. No, they ain't. They can see that. Yeah, they no can see it. What. That's the whole, that's the whole ticket. Might need. Look at this right there. I don't, I'm going to let her go. I don't want to hurt her. This right here. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. How in the hell did she got this? Underneath it. Yeah. Oh, yeah. She messed around a short struck it and it got her. Oh, man. Oh, there we oh, go. There we go. There we go. I was about to say, she might have to be kept. But... She's old on. She's a big old fish. I don't want to hurt her, man. All right. Oh, come on. Wait, wait, wait. There she goes. Got it. Nice. Oh, yeah. Don't literally. <laughs> there we go. That's a nice fish around 16 and a half, 17. She almost got that hook a little deep, but she's good. What's uh, dead load? What, 11? 11.30? 11.40? Yeah. And it, it ain't is, 1140. Uh, no, it's 1046. Okay, this changed an hour earlier. The tide chart is wrong. Yeah. This definitely coming in right here. Maybe they're on old time. Yeah. Maybe. <laughs> 1146 old time. I'll tell you what, in here, from what I know, is that I've fished this spot for 20 years. I can take it one day. When the tide comes in, this shuts down. So, it's a good indicator because we've thrown a few times now without nothing. Nothing. I hope it keeps up. I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna leave because I know that fact. That was a shell. Yeah. Back in and hit it. All right. On the Miradine incoming tide. Man, it's a nice fit. Yeah. Miradine's producing some monsters, man. Yeah, it is. And it's known for that, you know. Oh, yeah. oh wow. Yeah, these are golly whoppers right here, man. These are half the size of a loaf of bread. Yeah. 
<laughs> oh, clear lead. Yeah. <laughs> On the mirror dinghy lure. 16 and a half, I'd say. That's been about the average around 16 or so in this spot. It's a pretty fish right there. They got fat back on it. They really do. Inch and a half, two inches on the, yeah. on the top of there by the head. There's some meat on them. Yeah, they eating good. Yeah. It tells you that the, the crustacean, the shrimp are staying in here this season. They're, they're definitely healthy. Yeah, and they're thick. Yeah. Well, right good wild gone by since this morning. The tide's about halfway up now. We're headed home. So we're up to Little Satilla now. We're near Colonel's Island. And um, we've been, just started catching trout up on this bank over here where Josh is at. And then uh, I threw a mirror dean and caught one. Let's see what happens with that. There he is. Oh, I think there'll be another one there. I waited five damn minutes for that. That seems like a good fish there. Yeah, he's pretty good, man. He feels good. Oh, yeah, that's a pretty good fish, man. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, that's a big one. Oh, that's a big one, dude. That might be the biggest one we shot today. It is. Oh, yeah. We're oh, look at him. Oh, oh he's shaking. We're talking 20. 19 all day. Ooh. I think I should lift him. Oh, I don't know. Here, let me. All right, thank you. Watch them hooks, man. I got this one on the mirror, didn't y'all? Oh, you better grab him, Josh, for you. Oh, I think it's not full. Oh, baby, one set. We're still in him. Oh, wow. Man, this is what, this day, it started out crazy. Died for four and a half hours. Tide's about, I don't know, three eighths up, not quite half up. Coming back home, we decided to hit one bank that I know, and yeah, it's just fish up there, man. That's off of Miradine again, right there. That's about, I don't know, I'll call it 10, 12 fish today, all big wow. on the Miradine. Yeah. About that. time they started hitting me. Yeah, that's a good fish. Let's let her ride, Josh. No, I'm going to go Miradine. That's what I got, I guess, for that. Punishment. Watch that. Better watch that. Oh, damn, it's another good one, y'all. It's another good fish. It's like a trap. It was on bait. But, uh, oh, damn, I just missed one right here. But look at it. There he goes. There he is. Damn. It's a good bite in here, y'all. You losing? Oh, my God, man. Quality. Quality. Oh, yeah. Nice fish. On bait, but that's all right. That's a 17 inch right there, John. What a stellar day so far. Look at that out there. Look at that. Beautiful fish. Yeah, man. That's one. Yeah. It's a nice one. Pretty trout. Pretty trout. Bye, baby. This ain't the best for last. Thank you. Have, Have a fun. good day down there. Have fun. What, he's, what Josh gonna fish is uh, this is the Ozuri 3D peanut bunker. You can see it in there. This is a good bait. This one's a lot larger than the Miradine. This one's probably close to uh, three quarters of an inch longer. And uh, the hooks are bigger and it sinks a lot faster. But it's a peanut bunker, which is a, you know, it imitates, a, supposed to imitate a small pokey. And we've caught some fish on it today. It's already scratched up. But uh, yeah, we're gonna try that. Fishing with these hard lures means their diet's starting to change slowly because they're biting these these uh, fish imitations extremely well today. So the, the tides are changing, so to speak, with their diet going from crustaceans and shrimp to more like fin fish diet. It's, it's, it's starting to happen. It's a lot funner fishing with those anyhow, to me. Yeah. Hell, it's all fun. I know I say that about jigs, but I'll throw an electric chicken. Caught one off camera on that a while ago too. And lost a huge one right there at the boat. He bit the jig right at the boat and then came back to look at it and took off right in front of my eyeball. <laughs> <laughs> you saw him, didn't you oh, see yeah. that fish? Crazy stuff out there. Damn 18 today. inches. Yep. That's a fish. 
Oh, 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 nice. God dang, it's been, a fit. I was about, it's been 15 minutes. I know. I was going to say that we're done. We are done after this. We're going to leave on one if, if I get him in. Oh, yeah. Yep. Probably about the same deal, like 16, 16 and a half inches. Oh, yeah. Oh, man. That's yeah, he's a good yeah. fish, man. Yeah, he is. Oh, nice. He's got a little more fight to him. Yeah. <laughs> They cold, they like icicles when you grab them, man. Oh, still, buddy. Oh, still. He just got himself hooked again. Try not to hurt him, we ain't keeping him today, of course, so. Try not to mess him up. Tell you what we don't got, is no wind. No, at all. It's gonna require surgery. Minimally invasive, though. He's not willing to let go of that one hook. There it is. There he is. The pliers and everything. There he is. About 16, 16 and a half maybe. On the Miradine. Yeah. Stellar day. Yeah, man. Awesome day. Bye, buddy. It's real quiet out here without the wind blowing, man. We're even that wind's blowing 20 knots everywhere we went the other day. Yeah, now it seems like we're yelling. Hey, in this morning, I know. I feel yeah. like we need to be quiet. <laughs> Wait, there's anybody around here? Yeah.